Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating some apps right here on your Mac. So let's get started on the top left hand side of your screen. You're going to see the Apple logo, click on it, then go into your app store, which is the third option. System settings is usually for system updates and then app store would be where you update most of your apps. So right now we're going to go right there and we should see whatever apps need an update, which in this case, it's all of these guys. However, if you don't see a particular app, go into search. So up here in search, just type in, for example, Final Cut Pro, it's just as an example, and then you should see it here in updates. So you can click on update. It's gonna run that update. So let's just go back. And right here we can see this version 10.8. We also got compressor version 4.8. And then we got OneDrive. What else do we have down here below? We also have numbers, 14.1. Click, click on update and pages 14.1 as well. So those are the updates right now. Once they're done, they're just gonna move down here below and they can just open it up. Uh, for Final Cut Pro, if you're updating that, then go ahead, once you open it up, it's gonna tell you that you won't be able to open, fully open it unless you update other things. So just click on update and you should be good to go. So that's gonna update your library to be more specific and just make sure that you're not working on any projects or anything like that whenever you're running updates, just in case something goes wrong. Or sometimes the updates do have their own glitches. So I highly suggest finishing up any projects that you're doing, working with whichever of these things. It could be Pages, could be Final Cut Pro. Just finish those up and then run any updates. But as far as this video goes, we're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.